Hey Cavalry FC fans, it's uh, another edition of Sergio TV. Today I have a special guest with me, Nico Giantsopoulos, and we're going to ask him a few questions just to get to know him better. Here we go. Who was your favorite player growing up? Uh, Elias Sadaka. Elias Sadaka? Can you explain why? No, he played on my youth team, played together, and uh, he just gave 110% the whole time. So you didn't aspire to another professional player while you were growing up? You, you aspired to one of your teammates? Yeah. <laughs> a lot of people don't know, Nico and I uh, played on the same youth team together, so I know who Elias is. So uh, it's, it, it makes sense. Elias is a great, great person to look up to. What's going on, Elias? Shout out. <laughs> Favorite team? Probably the Toronto Maple Leafs. Toronto Maple Leafs, okay. Uh, I thought you were going to answer a soccer, r soccer team, but... Uh, then uh, Toronto FC. <laughs> okay, decent, decent. Any favorite players on Toronto FC throughout the years? Throughout the years, oh, there was this one player who played there one time. Uh, not many caps. Uh, his name was uh, Sergio Camargo. Uh, you know, talented footballer and uh, lucky enough to meet him once or twice uh, off the pitch. Where is he now? To be honest, probably he's retired. He, <laughs> the guy did not have the best career. <laughs> <laughs> Poor guy, man. It doesn't work out for everybody. Music, books, or movies? Movies. Movies? And what's a, what's a recent favorite that you've watched? Uh, to be honest, I don't know what it was called. Uh, we watched it. It's about this rock climbing guy. Yeah. What was it called? It was Free Solo. Free Solo. Yeah, it, it, won, a, it won an Oscar or a Grammy. What? Oh, Grammys for music. Grammys for music, so that's impossible. It won an Oscar and we watched it that same night. It's good. It was decent. What's your favorite holiday? Uh, Christmas. Christmas? Why Christmas? Uh, families all together. You know, warm weather, so yeah, it's good. Who is the best dancer on the team? I, if I had to guess, I'd put, you know, I'd put you in there, Serge. Um, and I'd put, you know, maybe uh, Malik. Malik? Yeah, I can see him having some moves. Six man. Tofa has a move too, he should probably show you guys his move. It's like something like, Jeez. something like that. Text or phone call? <laughs> phone call. Yeah, you're a bad texter for yeah, sure. No. Now, phone call or FaceTime? FaceTime, I want to see you. But, you know, not all the time. Sometimes, dude. If I got my AirPods in. I'm just, you know, cooking, cooking up some food. Just phone call. You don't need to cooking up me. some great stuff in the laboratory. <laughs> laboratory. What is your first memory of soccer growing up? Um, yeah, just house league. My uh, my dad was my coach, so just like playing in like the Timbits house league back uh, back home. Nice, decent. Uh, do you have a hidden talent that no, not many people know about? If I had a toothpick here. <laughs> I'm a, I'm a pretty good magician, so uh, maybe in the weeks to come, I'll bring a toothpick and I can do my magic trick. It's, uh, I've shown the boys and everyone's been impressed, so. Yeah, it's pretty impressive. It's pretty good. Who's the best trash talker on the team? Um, you know, I would say uh, Mace uh, and Nick. You know, they, they got some uh, different, different kind of insults, yeah. you know. It's the experience. It's the experience. They, they, they know what to get with the set to get under your skin. Yeah, sure. it works. Oh, and, and Jay, Jay Wielden, he's good. Yeah. You know, he might have ruffled some feathers the other day at training. Yeah. We won't name any names, Elijah. Yeah, Toph. And your headshot photo, do you usually smile or are you serious? I'm a happy guy. I'm happy guy. <laughs> Everything's awesome. Everything's great, you know, got nothing to complain about. I'm a big smiling guy. Yeah, I think we both are, <laughs> for sure. Uh, warm beach lounging or cool mountain skiing? Warm beach lounging. 100%. Like, no shot, like, it's not even close. Yeah. Which teammate would win the award as sharp dressed man? Not him. I have to put myself in there. Um, and you know what? I'll give uh, Elijah Adekubi some stuff. He's uh, ever since he signed that pro deal, he's been oh, every man. single day coming in. His hey, credit card hey, must lads, be hurting. How's it going, lads? Ah, ah, ah. Puts on the fake English accent out of nowhere. <laughs> it's, uh, it's good, yeah. yeah. Know, sharp dressed guy. Yeah. What is your guilty pleasure song? I know it, obviously. If and if you don't say this one, I'll bring it up as well. But what's your oh, guilty pleasure song? Shallow. Shallow, uh, Bradley Cooper, Lady Gaga, A Star Is Born. What a song. What, what a, a movie. Song. What a movie. Bradley oh, Cooper. man. Man Crush, Bradley Cooper. Yeah. What's going on, Brad? <laughs> <laughs> Do you have any pets? Uh, I got pets at home. I got a dog, Coco. Shout out to Coco. And uh, my sister's got a French bulldog, uh, Mocha. Shout out to Mocha. And I'm actually in the market looking to buy a dog now that I moved out here and got my place. So, uh, yeah, I will have another puppy of my own. Decent. And we'll share it, we'll take care of it. No, it's all you, bud. Dinner with anyone, past, present, or future, who would it be and why? Lonzo Ball. <laughs> oh my God, he has a man crush on Lonzo, Lonzo Ball. Lonzo Ball, for sure. He plays on the Lakers, uh, arguably the best uh, NBA player right now. 
Um, if I could add on to it, I'd just take the whole, his, his brother, his two brothers, his dad. The dad, for sure. And uh, his mom, Tina. Big, uh, Is she big interesting fans. as well? Big, yeah. Big baller brand. Big baller brand. Any pregame rituals or superstitions? No. Uh, I usually have the same meal. Pasta, some kind of protein in it. Whatever's on sale at Sintera Marketplace. <laughs> um, lots of water. Maybe maybe a little G-Sauce, some Gatorade. Some G-Sauce, yeah. decent. Ideal first date. Oh. For all the ladies out there. <laughs> <laughs> um, for sure, uh, uh, Canada's Wonderland, it's an amusement park. But if like I could like pick, I'd go to Disney World. Disney World? Unlimited budget, first date, Disney World, ride the rides. Uh, you know, get a little funnel cake at the end. Take the... That ride. <laughs> and uh, yeah, just in the evening though, all day event. What's that ride? It's not, a, is it a Ferris wheel? Yeah. <laughs> it's merry-go-round and Ferris wheel. Yeah, mixed up. <laughs> Favorite social media platform? Oof. I've been killing the gram lately. So I'm gonna have to say Instagram. I'm working on Twitter. I think Twitter's new. But um, yeah, Instagram. How do you Twitter. get your news? <laughs> Usually you tell me. <laughs> do you have any phobias? Are you afraid of anything? Snakes. Snakes? I lived in Australia for three years. Didn't see one snake. I don't know why I said that, <laughs> but I'm scared. I'm scared of snakes. So. Way to bring that up. I'm, I'm glad I didn't see him. <laughs> Have you ever seen a snake? Yeah, uh, so <laughs> Dallas Cup, we're walking, it's nighttime after dinner, walking dark. We're just walking through like a field of grass. Mm -hmm. No idea why. Not smart. Walking. The guy in front of me goes, whoa. And then I'm like, oh, that's weird. Boom, he jumps out of the way. There's like a coiled up snake, like lightheaded. And I'm like, if I pass out, I'm landing on you. it. <laughs> uh-huh. And I saw it. I, I didn't pass out, I just, I went, skirt. <laughs> So two stories, not that climatic, not that interesting. If you could instantly become an expert in something, what would it be? I'd be an expert gambler. Oh, that's right? decent, that's a good one. I'd be the best gambler in the world. Like sports and casino, or just casino you're talking about? Like poker? Poker, yeah. yeah. <laughs> poker for sure. Poker for sure? Yeah. Okay, decent. I should have said something like soccer. <laughs> <laughs> be an expert soccer player. <laughs> you already are though. Nico, thank you for uh, for joining me today on Sergio TV. Anytime. Hopefully we can have another one of these uh, talk sessions. Yeah. Uh, be sure to follow it, all, all our social media platforms. You Cavalry FC fans, we've got some great news on there for you. Uh, and stay up to date. <laughs>